Welcome to Blue Eye Media Tech Zone. Today we are going to talk about all new Raspberry Pi 4 Model B. Raspberry Pi 4B is a tiny, dual display, credit card sized computer. In this session we will be explaining the features, unpack and assembly of Raspberry Pi with its accessories. And finally the setup and configuration of operating system. Raspberry Pi 4B is coming with a 64-bit quad-core Broadcom processor with 1.5 GHz speed. In terms of memory, Raspberry Pi 4B is coming in 1 GB, 2 GB, 4 GB, and 8 GB variants. Raspberry Pi 4B is loaded with 2.4 GHz and 5.0 GHz wireless connectivity. It also has a powerful Bluetooth 5.0 connectivity. Let us take a look at its rest of the components. It is coming with a gigabit Ethernet, two USB 3.0 ports and two USB 2.0 ports. It has a four pole stereo audio and composite video port, camera serial interface, and two micro HDMI ports. Raspberry Pi 4 comes with a USB-C connector for input power supply. A standard adapter with minimum of 5 volt DC with 3 ampere can be used. The display serial interface can be used to connect to official Raspberry Pi display. There is a standard 40 pin GPIO header, these are programmable pins you can use it for engineering projects and robotics. If you turn the Raspberry Pi upside down, you can see the SD card slot, where you can insert the operating system loaded SD card. A minimum of 8 GB class 10 SD card is required. However, a 16 GB class 10 is preferable for smooth operation. Let's unbox it quickly. Raspberry comes in a beautiful red box. I have also brought official Raspberry power supply and micro HDMI cable. I already have a 16 GB class 10 SD card, a keyboard, and a mouse. Now let's fabricate the Raspberry Pi 4B with its accessories. Open the lid of Raspberry Pi case. Insert the Raspberry Pi 4B and close the lid. Let's connect the power supply to USB-C port. Now connect the micro HDMI pin to female socket. Now let's connect mouse and keyboard to the USB ports. Also I have connected my HDMI cable to TV's HDMI port. The fabrication is almost completed. It is the time to install operating system. Insert the SD card to laptop. If you are not using the laptop you need a SD card writer and connect it to your desktop's USB port. Open the browser and go to www.raspberrypi.org. Click on the download menu. Scroll down till you see the Raspberry Pi icon, then click on Raspberry Pi OS button. Now you are in Raspberry Pi OS page. Scroll down the page till you see Raspberry Pi OS, 32-bit, with desktop and recommended software. Click on the download zip button. The operating system starts downloading. Alternatively you can use a torrent download. It takes some time to complete the download as it has more than 2 GB of data. Once the download is completed, you need to download and install Etcher. Now open Etcher. 
Click on the select image and navigate to the downloaded zip file. Select the zip file. It is not required to unzip the file. Etcher automatically detected the SD card as I have already inserted it in laptop. It is now ready to flash the SD card. Click on the flash button to write the image into SD card. Wait until it is finished with flashing. Once the image is returned on SD card, you get a message flash completed. Now it is the time to insert SD card back to Raspberry Pi 4 and connect to power. Let's check the time taken for boot. Now Raspberry Pi 4B is ready to set up and update the software. I have already set up the Wi-Fi. Let's select the country, language, and time zone. Then click next. Now we can add a password and this will change the default Raspberry password, you need to change it, if you need to install a program in future. Click next if you don't have a black border around the desktop. Skip and click next to update the software. Once the updates are completed, you get a message, system is up to date, click OK and restart. Now the Raspberry Pi is ready to explore. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe the channel. Click on the bell icon to get notification.